respected man, and I think he is a very nice guy, and that he is a pretty cool man. I think Mr. Haycraft is all in all a pretty good guy. I mean, I know him personally from League Club, and I know at times he can be pretty feisty, but uh, he's a pretty good guy. See, I don't really know him that well. Um, you know, I've only had him once or twice, you know, and just overall he seems like a pretty good guy. He's a legendary bird nerd. There's something fishy about him. I mean, he does a lot of bird watching, which is kind of creepy. In my opinion, he could be doing some pretty weird things doing all these bird watching. But, uh, yeah. Uh, that he, he's probably some bird dude that, you know, wants to like, capture birds and stuff. I think he's some sort of, you know, villain slash superhero, you know, trying to make or, like, create or destroy mayhem, like, out in the cities, but yet, maybe he has a secret identity in Cuba, you know, going down there and doing stuff, you know, I, actually, I can't even tell you what I think he does, because I don't even have a clue what he does, but I know he has a secret identity in some, some other country, you know, maybe that's, uh, maybe that's over in Europe, I doubt it, it's probably Cuba. What's up with the Bird Shirt Monday? So Bird Shirt Monday was started by Mr. Hoffman. Um, he wanted to do the first Monday of every month um, wear bird shirts. So it was probably just him the first year. Um, then when I got here, I started doing it because um, believe it or not, I have a few bird shirts. Um, then Viber got involved, Mrs. Greenback's been involved, Mrs. LeBoard has. Um, there's probably some other teachers too that I'm missing, but yeah, so it's the first Monday of every month and uh, students feel free to do it as well. Are you a volunteer or a staff member? Uh, contrary to popular belief, everyone thinks that I am actually a paid staff member. That is, however, untrue. I'm just volunteering here because I love spending time with you guys and I love the free internet. Do you play a league while you're here? Not a lot to play league. No, Mel has that nice and locked. What are some of your favorite students? Who my favorite students? Um, Stephen Granger has to be up there as one of my favorite. Not really. Uh, Bryce Collins is probably one of my favorite little knuckleheads. And obviously Brendan Olson. Why do you like Brendan Olson so much? Because he pulls off a mohawk like no other. Why do you hate Stephen Granger? I never said I hated Stephen Granger. I just facetiously said he was one of my favorites. What do you think of Graham Watson? Mm, a little ugly, but not a bad dude. Uh, Zeus. Yo. What you doing over there? Watching YouTube videos. Oh, okay. So, just thought maybe you wouldn't do your uh, one of your 13 missing assignments you have here. No, man, looks like a tight outside would be better. Maybe you do a little less dabbing, a little more uh, law. Maybe you'd be uh, getting ahead in life a little bit. Yeah, dude. Those 13 missing times won't even count, man. I don't even got to take finals. They're all going to count. For what? Let's see. Your grades Your grades are awful. No shot, seeing what you're doing over there. Hey, you're, uh, let's see, you've got one B, that's your best grade. You're failing elementary aid. How is that even possible? I didn't even know that was graded. How's that possible? Oh, well, I, I just don't feel past the time. I don't even call over. Zeus? I just go home from time to time. One of these days, I'm telling you, brother. It's coming. Okay, I'll get El Chapo on you. Coming. El Chapo's not going to save you. I don't know. He could have. What do you think of me? I try not to. It's a racing, isn't it? <laughs>